to Onglor. Welcome to the video. Glad to have you here. Today we'll be meeting Lexa, a follower for Skyrim Special Edition that is available on the PC. And if you guys decide to give this mod a try, there is an introduction that I recommend you guys read. Just to give a little bit of a spoiler, Lexa befriended one of the most famous vampires in Skyrim, and I think most of us know who that is. So, what we're going to do first is meet her, and as you can already tell, she is a vampire, and she can be married, and also she has a variety of uh, spells as well, such as Ice Spike, Ice Storm, Mist Form, and a couple more. And also, there was something that she could summon when it actually just came out of nowhere, shocked me, and when it went into action, I was like, whoa, it's pretty strong, and we'll take a look at that a little bit later in the video. Now, on the mod author's page, she is listed to be found at the Moor Side Inn. I initially went there looking for her, but there is a deserted den that is very close to it, and that's where I actually found Lexa. But, this is where the mod becomes more than just a follower mod, because as we walk inside, we can see this place is really well decorated. It's actually quite spacious as well, and then upon further investigation, I saw that there was crafting stations there, uh, such as alchemy, enchanting, smithing, etc. And there's also an NPC there that you can sell or buy valuables from. Also, she acts as a fence as well. So if you have anything stolen, she's not going to ask any questions. It's just going to be like, here is the gold. And this is where I found Alexa. And I think she looks really well done. And I can't wait to test her out because upon testing, you just never know how followers are going to be. But... A little bit back to the den here. So this place isn't really listed as a f uh, follower home, but you can easily turn it into one if you want to because you have all the crafting stations here, plenty of places to sit, plenty of places to store items, and also if you enjoy coffins, well, there's plenty of coffins for you to sleep in as well. So that is one little surprise along with the NPC that I thought was really well. And it makes me think to myself, you know what? It's mod like these that the Creation Club could take an example from because I think it's really well done and I would totally not mind paying somewhere like around 300 top bucks for this type of mod. Okay so as I was taking her out to test in battle I'll tell you what she is very very strong and when I saw this gargoyle come out and just start slapping people around I was like whoa this is really cool and just her spells in general are pretty strong and she also comes with a dagger as well and I didn't put anything on Lexa at all. I didn't give her any spells any special armor this is just her kind of right out of the box and she is very very powerful because there are times when you get followers you have to give them a lot of things to make them work but Lexa's like nope I am here and ready to go not only does this follower look really good but she also can be married if you want to do so she is also very powerful as well and you have a couple added bonuses with the I don't want to say player house but the den and the NPC as well I think this mod is just really really good and I highly recommend you guys give it a shot so if you do want to try it out a link for it will be in the description below all right guys that's the end of the video I really want to thank you for watching and if you'd like to see more Skyrim special edition mods please hit that subscribe button also if you enjoyed the video smash that like button it would definitely mean a lot to me all right guys I will see you in the next video take care